I think something's... Or someone's shooting at us from a long ways away. I just don't know exactly where they're at. Maybe way up there? Oh, God, that hurt. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on Tale of Two Wastelands with the Capital Punishment Modless. I'm the Bearded OG, and in this episode, I think we're going to go up and do Moira's Minefield, but I'm in a Megaton right at the moment, and there's a couple things I wanted to do on camera with you guys. I just finished uh, getting all healed up and rehydrated and selling all my stuff. I'm pretty much penniless now, but I'm in perfect health now. Um, and um, so we got this android from the Commonwealth thing that we got from the other doctor and uh, now that opened up a new dialogue option with Doc Church. So let's see what he has to say about this. Thought that hoax was long in the grave. Here, take this holotape and hear it for yourself. That was just some bored prankster. Forget about it. Hmm. Tell me more about the holotape and the android. You got wax in your ears? I said it was a hoax. Practically every doctor in the Capital Wasteland got a hollow tape like that. Go bother someone else. Uh, okay. Yeah. Let's see what the hollow tape has to say. Uh, go to data. Miscellaneous. If you're listening to this recording, it is because you're believed to be trustworthy. I hope that is the case because this recording puts us both in danger. I'm escaping from the Commonwealth. I'm an android, a synthetic man, a slave. The men hunting me are ruthless and will stop at nothing to retrieve their property. I need to find a doctor in the wasteland to perform facial reconstruction. I also need someone who knows a great deal about computers. I need... I need to have my memories erased and my face altered to look like someone else. Hmm. Okay. Very interesting. Uh, whoops, wrong door. All right, now, um, I also leveled up and what I did for that is let's go to stats I put a point I put uh, five points into repair so now we're 30 which will allow us to repair the water pipes in town here and then I also put points into explosives I put four points into explosives and then for our perk, I took uh, Lady Killer because we're already at Gun Nut Three. And then the next perk I'm planning on doing will be um, uh, ba uh, Bachelor, whatever the one is for for the men. Okay. So um, we should be able to fix these now. And we have 30 repair skill. Nice. Okay, so we repaired that. There's two more leaks. I urge you, my friends, come, drink with me and There's one up here. Okay, let's get this one repaired. Nice. And then we got to find the final one. I think the final one's in a little bit more of a jank spot. There it is. Uh, there we go. Very good. We fixed all the leaking pipes. Walter! What do you need? Well, the pipes are all fixed. Well, I'll be. The pressure's up in the plant. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. You're welcome. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. Okay. If I have a steady supply of scrap, 
I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Sure. Sounds good. I'll bring you the parts I find. Good. This just keeps looking oh, better. You just Those gave me a hundred caps. Nice. This place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. Okay. Um. Hey, we are now accepted in Megaton. Look at that. Cool. Hey, um. Yeah. What is it? Do I have some? Interested in buying some scrap metal? I sure am. Actually, oh, I guess I don't have any. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> um. Now that it's working better, can I use the water purifier? My yeah. That thing is very valuable around here, but you helped us, all right? Oh, I wonder if this is a quest add-on because he's not voicing this. I mean, it would make sense, right? I'll let you use it for a couple of days, but after that, I'll have to charge some caps. Oh, okay. I'm sure you understand. If you find the water purified locked, go find me and we'll work it out. Yeah, okay. Cool. Well. So, clean water connector. Open. Dude, there's nothing in there. Hmm. Okay. It, uh, wait a second. Is that taking money from me? It sounds like it's taking, taking caps. Uh, we have 216 caps. No, it's just the noise it makes. So, yeah, I guess we have to come back later and grab those, but it but it is only going to let us do it for a couple of days. So, God hopefully bless the USA So, hopefully no the next time else. we come here, it'll still be available to us at no charge. All right, I think we're finished here in Megaton for now. Um, unless we want to... Should we try and disarm the bomb? I have a little bit higher explosives now than I had before. If we fail at it, does it blow up? <laughs> I guess it'd be game over at that point, wouldn't it? Um, you know what, though? I don't have that... I don't have that explosives helmet that gives me plus 10 explosives. I think if we're going to attempt this, we should probably be wearing that. So let me go grab it and I'll be right back. Is everyone from the vault as kind as you? Um. Don't let the people around here fool you with their hippie crap. Not... <laughs> <laughs> They're hippie crap. <laughs> he is coming with the <laughs> That's funny. Okay, let's put the uh, Blastmaster helmet on, which gives us plus 10 explosives. And um, let's also take a Rad X because we're going to get radiated when we get near it. Okay. Every ear shall be Here goes nothing. To hear the thunder. You don't even know how to to start to approach the arming or disarming process for this. What? Okay. His voice. Let the men, women, I and children guess of the earth we need more explosives. That's thirty-five. I don't know how high we need it needs to be. It doesn't tell us. It told us how high we needed to be to do the repairs. Yeah, I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do then. Only, my only guess is we need higher explosives. Okay, well, it was worth a try. Okay, let's go ahead and... Head on up to Moira's minefield. And we will do that quest next. I will see you guys when we get up that direction. The first first part of the trip up there is territory we've already been over a few times. All right, let's take a look at the map here. I need to actually head that direction. See if there's anything... 
significant around here first though since we're here probably not okay let's go this way I heard some gunfire over that direction but I'm not uh, I'm not sure what uh, aside from having to deal with mines of course not sure what else uh, we're going to run into. You know, I should probably be trying to kill those with my pistol because they give you diseases otherwise. We have a Protect Tron over there, and we have... One or two people walking around up this way. It looks like a bandit to me. All right, we have a caution, which means there's we alerted something else too. Oh, it was just that mole rat, which is almost dead and now is dead. All right, let's go. Let's go look over here for a minute. We've got a cabinet. Dirty business pre-war, uh, pre-war dirty business wear something. Yeah, that stuff. A couple of containers here. Have anything to cook? More rat steak. And a septic in the mailbox. Because that's what you should expect to find in mailboxes antiseptic. Nothing in the trunk. Alright, we'll take that stuff. An easy safe, but yeah, we can't do easy. We only do very easy. We'll work on that. We'll get there. Leaf blower, coolant, conductor, steady, lawnmower blade. All right, let's go up and loot this bandit we took out. I mean, raider. I always get raider and bandit mixed up, but they're kind of the same thing, I suppose. A tin grenade straight razor. These look like maybe railroad tracks? At one point, anyway. Is that, uh... Resty Station or whatever. Our train yard? No, that's something else that we haven't discovered yet. Temple of the Union and Canterbury Commons. Canterbury Commons must be a community. Because we're neutral with them. Oh, I see red. It is... A mantis. I don't think mantises can give us diseases, or at least if they can, I haven't gotten one from one yet. The mole rats certainly can. Oh! We discovered the scrapyard. Okay. We're detected. I don't know what we're detected by. Whatever or whoever it is, they're not attacking us straight out. So that's always a a plus in this game.
Okay, well, we may come back here. Well, I'm sure we will come back here for sure, but... Uh, oh, there's a substation. Let's go over there and see if we can find the fuses we need. And there's Lucky. Man, that guy gets around. Here to shop? Have a look. Okay. It's my pleasure to offer hot death in a variety of exciting flavors. Okay, you know what, Lucky? I need Take to change my clothes. Hold on a second. Until we meet. Put on our trader outfit. Looking for that special. Please enjoy my selection okay. of high quality problem solvers. High pro quality problem solvers he has. Don't want to sell any of our weapons. We'll sell that. You know, I, I'm not I'm not using this vampire's edge at all. It's really cool looking though, but I think I want to store it. So let's give you that. We'll give you that. We'll give you both of those. All the pre-war money. And then any junk items. Okay, let's accept. That gives us 246 caps. Do you have any antique coach gun? Huh. Uh, do you have any weapon repair kits? He does not. HK MP9 compensator. Uh, you got... Oh, frag mines. Yeah, that's actually what we need. We're out completely out of frag mines. How am I doing? Okay, I've got quite a few 308s for our sniper rifle. Got a decent amount of 357s, decent amount of 10s. Yeah, we're actually pretty good on ammo, so I think I'm going to buy frag mines from him. So we can buy up to 246 caps worth of frag mines. Let's just buy that many. Okay, very good. Give Thanks, me a Lucky. shout if you need anything else. Will do. Keep your Okay. Man, I run into that trader more than any other trader. He really does get around. That's a good thing. That is a good thing. Okay. Let's uh, continue on towards the mine field. And, yeah, at some point, I'm sure we'll get back to the scrapyard. We're here. This is minefield. Okay, so. What we're going to do is we're going to keep the Blastmaster helmet on just because I believe it will... I mean, it gives us more ex explosives, 10 more. And I think that helps us with disarming mines. And possibly with, um, you know, the delay before the mine goes off, maybe. So the name of the game here is keep your eyes on the ground as much as possible. Or at least when we advance, we watch the ground and we advance and then we look up to see if something else is coming after us and so forth. That is a cinder block. Okay, I see one right there. You know, it just occurred to me, too. I'm such a noob. Hey, there's blood going into that house. We, we just bought all those fragments. We're probably going to get a whole bunch of them for free. Oh, well. We'll use them all. Okay, so we got that one. Uh, let's let's get all the mines, at least the ones off the road first, before we maybe investigate houses and things. Salesman Weekly, I bet you that gives us barter points. Yep, okay. Trying to remember to take that. Th oh, uh, danger, danger, where's danger?
You know what? Let's go over here and discover this. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Another mole hole. Smoke chaser mole holes. Oh! These are soldier ants. They're a little bit tougher than the other ones. Okay. All the fighting has seemed toward something or other. Oh, there's a protectron. Let's stay away from him. Are you shooting at me? No, he's probably shooting at ants. Yeah, let, we'll let him deal with the ants. All right, so let's put this away. And here we go. There's a, a body over there. What? Oh shit, somebody's shooting at us. Is it you? Dude, what the hell? Uh, wrong weapon. Fuck! That hurts. Okay. Let's take a... Yeah, let's take a combat stim because we are almost dead. Fuck did you come from? Alright, you wanna go long range? A stuck spear. Okay. All right. I guess, uh, nope. We're still in danger. Stop moving. Terrible. Terrible shooting. It's embarrassing. Okay, what's that over there? I guess the one good thing about the flashing is it helps us spot things. Oh, it's just an ant. Okay. Alright, let's go back over here again. Combat stem is worn off. Ah, uh, let's see. Do we have any food for healing? Yeah, we got fire roasted corn. None of that stuff gives hit points. Um, let's take a Bandage and an antiseptic. Every time I hear that, it freaks me out. We have our... Damn that. I, I should should look in the any file and see if there's any way I can brighten this up. It's just pathetically... 
bad. Okay, we got that one. Okay, are we... We're still in danger. Why are we in danger right here? Oh, but let's get this reloaded. Make sure you're loaded. Make sure you're loaded. Alright, at least it changed to caution now. Now it says danger again. Is it because we're in proximity to the mines? I can't loot that guy. Hacks. Hmm. Do we look in here? Yeah. All right. Ooh. What the fuck was that? I think something's... Or someone's shooting at us from a long ways away. I just don't know exactly where they're at. Maybe way up there? Oh, God, that hurt. <sighs> okay. Let's do another bandage and a couple of expired stim packs. see something flashing over there. We're still healing healing up. The bandage just wore off. Let's do another one. Okay, we gotta find out where the sniper is. getting shot as we go up the road. You know what I'm thinking too? It's getting dark. What time is it? 7.42 p.m. I wonder if we, if we can go inside this house and just sleep for the night. The house with the, the bloody footprints going into it. You can't oh shit! That scared the hell out of me. Here. We need, uh... <sighs> Ignore negative effects plus one. And let's try a solve at all. We don't want to get addicted. And another stim pack. Want some more? No! Arkansas? <laughs> He's got a gun called Little Rock. Okay, and a Ridgefield gate key. All right. Well, we never had a chance to learn about Arkansas because he pretty much tried to kill us. <laughs> Fucker. Uh, okay, let's take a look at Little Rock. This is a 308 rifle. With a bonus critical chance. It's got a nice scope on it. It even holds more steady than the, the normal 308 sniper rifle. How does this compare? This is... I mean, it's, it's a little more damage than the sniper is. I'd ha oh, this has a bonus critical, too, though. Hmm.
I think this is overall better. This one seems to be a little more steady though. Okay. Anyway, let's uh let's see if we can get in this house and find a bed just to sleep till daytime. And I'm also a noob because I'm not even wearing my good armor. That's par for the course. No wonder we're taking so much fucking damage. Alright, I have no idea what we're going to encounter in here. Gibson House. Uh. So, the key... How did we... How did we get in here? We don't have Gibson House key. We still have caution too. Tumblers today. That's lock picking, I believe. Oh, what the frick? Yeah. Oh, plus two permanent lock pick. Nice. I'll take it. Nothing in those filing cabinets. Just rad roaches in here. Toy car. Bunch of food. Dandy boy apples. stuff. Okay. Guess that's it for downstairs. Let's go upstairs. Oh good, I can't sleep in those beds. But loot loot first. Read Wonder Tales from Many Lands The Four Wishes. 70 pages. Come on, man. Who wants to stop in the middle of playing a video game and read a 70-page story? I mean, seriously. <laughs> if we could maybe pick it up and take it back to our house and read it at night? Maybe, but... Uh, those are very heavy crutches. Cherry bombs. Lunchbox. Okay, let's finish the house first, and then we'll... Then we'll sleep. Nice. We got an easy safe. A couple of dead people. Yep, dead people on the bed. I take it this was their house. Working with hands. That uh, No, I'm not doing it. Sorry. Too fucking long. That's ridiculous. I mean, a, a maybe a 10-page story is okay, but that's, that's like, no way, man. Not for me, anyway. Okay, so I think we've cleared the house. Let's sleep till morning. We'll get up at 7. We can't take... Uh, how much is that? That's not worth much. Alright, we've got to find out who this asshole is that's taking pot shots at us while we're trying to disarm mines up the street. Let's, um... Take an expired stim and... A, a bandage. That should get our hit points pretty much close to all the way back. 
I wasn't wearing my armor either, of course, so th that was having a huge impact on how much damage we were taking. Oops. All right, here we go. Okay, we're currently hidden. No longer in danger. Maybe the asshole that was shooting at us is gone. We're going to find out here soon enough, I suppose. We got landmines up here. All right. I know this kind of screws up our our vision a little bit, but I want that plus 10 explosives. Okay. Another lawnmower blade, or did we already loot this? Nope. I don't even know what the hell you use those for, but they're a crafting item, so... Take all that stuff. Uh, and we're encumbered now. Okay. Story of our life. Just keep your eyes on the ground. Oh man, there is a bunch of landmines up here. Yeah, I don't know why the hell I spent all that money with Lucky to buy mines when we're going to pick up who knows how many from doing all this. Wasn't one of my brighter moves, but it is what it is. Okay, it says to use a key, but we can get in anyways. Oh, unlocked with the ridge, ridge. Is this town called Ridgefield? Maybe, um, maybe Little Rock was the mayor. A Braxo cleaner. All right, you know what? We're just going to be encumbered again, because that's what we do, is we get ourselves encumbered. A lot of loot in here. Fuck off, Radroach. Didn't Moira say this place was supposed to be haunted or something? Maybe we'll run in some ghosties. What is that? That's a pistol called Snake Lore? Hmm. I'm intrigued. This is a 45 auto pistol with a laser sight. Does it wait, does it have a silencer on it too? It does. This is a nice weapon, you guys. It needs some some TLC, but we fix this thing up and it's going to it'll replace our 10 millimeter pistol. All right. Well, that was worth the price of admission. I love it. Can't use it, though, until we fix it. Grognak the Barbarian. That gives us something, doesn't it? Uh, wait, nope. Permanent melee weapons, plus two. Nice. We'll take it. Oh, you're still alive? Cut it out. Oh, we never went down this way.
I'm happy we found that pistol. There's a safe, but we can't open it. Nice. We'll take all of that. Dead people. Guess we'll take that. Turpentine. A leather belt. So I wonder if Little Rock was leading people to believe that he was haunting the place. Maybe. I don't know. I do not know. Working with hands. Nope, 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 nope. Not doing it. We already checked this lawnmower. Yeah, we did. We dro dropped that Blastmaster helmet. Nothing in that mailbox. Why does everybody have a lawnmower on the side of their house? In this town. That's what I want to know. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. That stupid fucking C key. Yeah. Can I? Here. Let's see. Controls. Action mapping. C is attack. But I don't need C to be attack because that's what the left mouse button does. Can we change this to some other key I'll never hit like that one? Okay. <laughs> Good. That'll take care of that. Okay. All right, let's be on the lookout for landmines. Not really seeing anything in this house. Well, we are going to have a bunch of frag mines when we're finished here. Lawnmowers and leaf blowers and landmines. The triple L. Why does that say I'm stealing these? I just now noticed that. Well, so far we haven't received any bad karma for it. Or if we have, it's been so minus minuscule that it hasn't registered yet. Hey, a reloading bench with a bunch of stuff. Nice. All right, we'll take that. Kind of an interesting place for a loading reloading bench to be. Is this the place where we were being shot at? We can't open that. We'll take 308 rounds. Oh, yeah, we will. Maybe this is where Arkansas hung out at. He was sniping at us while we were down on that lower street there. That would be my guess. Maybe he's the asshole that planted all the landmines, too. He didn't have, like, any lore or anything like that on him for us to read to try and figure out what's going on. But maybe we'll still find that. Because we're not done yet.
All right, we made it to the merry-go-round, and that uh, completes the quest. I'm going to um, go back down this street, though, and go through the remaining house or houses um, and pick up the rest of the landmines. We currently have uh, 47. Nice. That'll last us for a while. And uh, I'll, I'll keep the camera rolling, but if nothing real significant happens, um, I'll, I'll probably just meet you guys back. Let's see. What? Yeah, I might meet you, uh, just meet you all the way back at Moira's in Megaton. Okay, we'll see what happens, though. All right, guys, uh, we are over at this substation. Um, and I'm going to go see if I can find those fuses for our place. Also, we have a total now of 64 frag mines that I pulled out. Well, we had, we didn't pull 64 out because we had some already with us. I don't remember what the count was. Um, but we got, uh, we got quite a few frag mines, which is amazing. I also found this kind of, this unique weapon called the needler pistol. It shoots nails. Not particularly impressed with uh, its damage, but... It is uh, unique, if nothing else. So yeah, let's uh, let's go over here and see if we can figure out what's going on uh, in terms of finding fuses. And we got a Nuka Cola Quantum right there, a BB gun, and it looks like some BBs. This guy was just sitting there. I noticed there was a Nuka Cola up there too, so I wonder if he was. Yeah, he must have been plinking those bottles <laughs> from down here. All right, let's go over here and see if we can find some fuses. I don't know if this is going to be a quick grab kind of thing or if it's going to be more involved. It's probably going to be more involved because it's nothing's ever easy, but we'll see. But yeah, we won't uh, be needing frag mines for a while, which is amazing. Of course, I took the long way around. Oh no! Seriously? Oh, we're detected by something. Got to get away! They're burning everything! What? Wh who's burning what? They're all dead! Burned Grey Ditch right to the ground! Those things! They came out of nowhere! You've got to run! Run! What? Oh, where the hell is Grey Ditch? What the fuck are you talking about? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> well, shit. It doesn't look like we're going to be able to get to our fuses till we have lock picking 25. <sighs> All right, I have... I can give myself five more temporarily, but of course that's not enough. So we're probably going to put our next points into lock picking anyways because I keep, you know, missing out on stuff. Because I don't have it. And also, damn it, I forgot to put this helmet back on so we can all see better. Um, alright, well shit. I guess we're not going in here right now after all. So we'll have to come back here later. Just have to remember that it's just a little bit southwest of the, the minefield. That's a bummer. And how, how would one get those off? Oh, maybe we shoot them down with the BB gun. Hmm. Doesn't seem to uh, be knocking it down. <laughs> okay. That doesn't seem to be working, so I guess we won't worry about that. All right, we got a bit of a, a trek to get uh, back home. So, like, as usual, I'll keep the camera running in case something crazy happens. Otherwise, I will see you guys back in Megaton for our turn-in with Moira. And we have a lot of stuff to sell, too. I discovered the infested reservoir. Um... It's got like a 
little irradiated thing going on there. Which I don't want to go down inside of. Alright, we marked it on the map if we want to come back here at some point. Alright guys, we are at Megaton and Lucky is back here. Looking to make a tr looking to trade? I am looking to trade. What you got, bud? It's my pleasure to offer hot death in a variety of Looks like he still has some flavors. of the money we get, Take got your for pick. him. Okay. I'm going to sell all of that. We got 140 darts. We got a lot of darts at the village there. We can have the whiskey, the Mad X. Oh, I found this DC Journal of Internal Medicine in, in that last house I went into as well. So we'll read that. We have all of that stuff. 64 frag mines. That's amazing. We have the throwing spear, the belly club, the cleaver, the machete, the baseball bat. Uh, let's see here. All of this armor he can have. We're going to make some, some bank on all this stuff. Uh, Blastmaster. Yeah, he can have that. And all of the junk. Okay, so that gives us gets us 384 caps. Oh yeah, let's sell sell the Brahmin skin thing too. And, and I'm gonna just sell this. Well, maybe I'll keep it back at our base. I'm not gonna keep carrying it around though. The snake armor. The minute I do that, then I'm probably gonna need it for something. Okay, now um, I want your 357s. Right, we want to start collecting 45 rounds um, because we have that pistol now, but we've got to get that pistol repaired, though, too. He doesn't have any repair kits. Okay, except that. That brings us down to 208 caps. Very good. Okay. A pleasure doing business with you. Of course. Did you have high repair skill? I'll I can't remember. I... Oh, yeah. He's got 59 repair skill. Um, You know, I should have brought that damn uh, 45 with me. I left the back of the base. Okay. The cowboy repeater 8% for 15 caps isn't bad. 18% on the sniper rifle. I think I'll wait on that just a bit longer. You know, I don't really use this submachine gun very much. I wonder if I should just sell it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hold off. Okay, let's go talk to Moira. I've heard about you. Have you? Let it never be said that there aren't some good people left in the world. Damn straight. Oh, let's go see before we actually talk to Moira. Let's see if there's any water in here for us. Uh, no, what am I doing? Oh, shit. We never t were able to take advantage of that. All right, Walter, how much do you want yeah. for water? What is it? Uh, personal space, dude. 70 caps to use the water purif purifier. Does that mean that I can drink unlimited then? Sure, you got the purifier working right again. But if it runs out of water to pump, then we're still screwed. That's not my problem. Okay, let's wait on that. We'll come back. We'll come back to that. How thirsty am I? I think I'm pretty thirsty. Yeah, we're we're decently thirsty, all right. This is the first time I think we've come back to Mega Megaton without any negative effects, though. And we don't even have that much radiation, either. So what that means is we don't really need the dock to heal us up. Uh, our head's not in the best of shape, though, I suppose. Okay, well, let's go talk to Moira first before we do anything else. How, how are those hot little potatoes? Oh, oh, 
or whatever. You know what I mean. <laughs> I got through the minefield life, and I even brought you a present. My very own landmine. Oh, just what I've always wanted. Well, always <laughs> since I sent you out on this anyway. Yeah, well, you be careful with that thing. Now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? What's it like disarming a landmine? Well, you got to be real fast, and you don't want some asshole shooting at you while you're trying to do it. Just jump up and down on it. You go first. Uh, the whole place was a death trap. Lots of places are nowadays. Good work staying alive in tough conditions. It'll be a great example for the book. Okay. I know you may not want to see any more explosives for a while, but obviously you know your way around them. Have a couple rainy day toys of mine. Rainy day toys? And looking at this landmine gives me an idea. It's a terrible device that does terrible things, of course. Not if you're fighting super but mutants. It's easy to make your own, too. Oh, you're going to give me the recipe? More frag grenades. Bottle cap mine added. Schematics. Oh, nice. The bottle cap mines are even better than the frag mines. That's amazing. Okay. That uh, that completes the first chapter's task, correct? Yep. You've done a great job. I just need to add in the section on how to cook rat. And this chapter's <laughs> done. Okay. What about mole rat? Here, for your services, I've saved up quite a few stim packs. Of course, you may need them. We still have got two more chapters to go. Yeah. Okay. Four stim packs. I'm ready to start researching the next the chapter. The second chapter is going to be a bit trickier, I think. It'll cover how to handle creatures out there, for better or worse. For example, repelling mole rats, uh, learning about mirelurks, and when all else fails, how to handle being injured. Do I have to take on mirelurks? I don't like mirelurks. So let's buckle down and get to work on this chapter. What's first? Uh, I'm going to hate myself for this, but what do you mean about and delete injury. Uh, do, let's just start from the top. Repelling mole rats. Mole rats can burrow into almost anything and cause a lot of trouble. So I figured I'd make a chemical repellent stick for people to shoo them off. Okay. But I need it to be tested before I put the recipe to paper in the guide. So I need you to find some mole rats and test it out a bit. Mm. Why do I not like the sound of that? All right, we'll test it. It'll be easy. One tap with the applicator, and it overwhelms their senses with a sort of feel-bad sensation. Then they're gone before you know it. Yeah, we'll see. You could test it out on just a few mole ratties, but for real testing, try it on ten or more. There should be plenty in the tepid sewers downtown. Oh, the tepid sewers. Great. Okay. Um... Uh, I've been thinking about the guide. Can I ask you something? Got any info on an Android mind wipe? Here's a hundred cap research fee. No, I'm not giving her hundred caps for that. Yeah, what do you sure got for sale? Thing. Ooh, she's got 506 caps. I don't think I actually. I think we sold everything we wanted to sell though. Uh, well, no, actually, we have all this these drugs we can sell her. Atomic cocktail. Eh, no, I think I'm going to sell that. She can have the blo blo uh, blo blo bloat fly meat and mole rat meat. Anything that's spoiled, we will give to her. I'm going to actually keep these two because A, they're not spoiled, and B, they give hit points. I'm going to give her all of these, though. Um, Moira, do you have, here, let's accept, do you have a weapon repair kit? Doesn't look like she does.
Okay. Do you have 45 rounds? You do not. Wow, she's got 61 five, five, sixes, though. That's good. Alright, let's buy up all her ammo. Oh, well, all the ammo that we'll use. Especially want the armor piercing for super muties. Okay, she gave us some stim packs too, which is great. Click accept. And Good we're hunting. Done. You got. She has forty-four repair. Nah. Try. Try not to die. Exactly. All right. Good. And we've leveled up too. We just gotta. We gotta sleep. So did she? Wait, did she give us? Yeah, she gave us the bottle main weapon schematic. So, lunch boxes, cherry bombs, sensor modules, and ten bottle caps. Okay, I'm, I looted a bunch of cherry bombs. Um, if we look at... I think I have a bottle cap mine. I do. Okay, so this guy, this thing does 59 damage compared to a frag mine, which does 59 damage. Uh, okay. Well, that's not something we're going to be making anytime soon. Since we have so many frag mines and they do the same amount of damage. We'll use those up first. But we will start, you know, hanging on to that stuff. Okay, let's go up to the water plant. We'll pay, uh... Uh, what the hell is this guy's name again? Willard? Wilson? Walter. Uh, huh? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait, did he just say we could use it for a week? Dude, there's nothing in it. Okay, what the fuck? There's no water in it. Walter. Yeah? What the what hell, man? It? Oh, do I have any scrap metal? I don't. Okay. Um, I think he said we have access to it for a week, though, and if that's the case, then that's not a bad deal. What? Uh, let me go back and look in the video really quick. Okay, yeah, he did say I could use it for a week. Um, it's just that when I need it, there isn't anything in it. That's very irritating. Shit, okay. Well, all right, how bad are we again? Eh. Okay. I think we're going to have to drink from the fountain and go do the have the dock fix us up thing again we have 130 caps or actually I guess what we could do is no that's not what I wanted to do we do have one more immuno booster so if we take that we don't need to pay him to fix us up. We can remove diseases ourselves and just pay him to get remove the radiation. 349. So that means we need to drink 12, 14 times. And we get sick on the very first drink. Of course we do. Okay, we are in really good shape. I mean, technically, we don't even really have that bad of radiation. Um, but we have hunting sickness, mutant parasites, and the runs. So we will take care of that by... Uh, nope, 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 nope. By taking this. You no longer feel sick. Okay. So I would say overall we're in pretty good shape. We do have... I mean, our head's not in the best of shape, though, is it? That radiation is so minuscule. I might let it go. And we do have... You know, we do... Wait a second. Am I supposed to be... 
Whoop. Nope. Sorry. Oh, am I supposed to be putting dirty water in here to purify it? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Clean water collector. So, do we put empty bottles in here and then... Oh, okay. I think that's what we're supposed to be doing. I do indeed. Okay, well, I've got a bunch of bottles back at, you know, empty bottles. Back at the garage. What I was, uh, what I was actually saying too, by the way, is that when we do get significantly irradiated, it heals our limbs because we got that perk from Moira. So in a way, it's almost not a bad thing for us to get irradiated, except for it does screw up our health cap a bit. So I'd really like to get that 45 pistol repaired and start using it, but I don't have a whole bunch of 45 ammo. Want to grab the snake lore? And just see how much Moira can repair it for us. I currently have... Uh, oh, shit. I only have eight 45 auto rounds. Well, and then we have these, though, too. I'm trying to remember what the P means. I like this weapon. It's kind of, it's got a cool sound to it, though it's a little bit on the loud side. They mix the audio on that a bit loud. All right, let's take a quick nap so we can level. We'll just sleep for an hour. All right, we are, we're going to dump all of our points into lock picking. I think. Barter explosives. Yeah, let's just put them all into lock picking. And then we were going to do the bachelor one on this one. Confirm bachelor. There we go. Okay, so now we do 10% more damage to both males and female humans. And we have, uh, can have extra dialogue. All right, let's run back and see if we can figure out this water thing. And I also want to see, like I said, how much Moira can repair that weapon for us. To dress you a if, we can, if we can get it a little over half repaired, it'll probably be worth using. If it's under half, I think it'll just jam on us too much. Okay, so let's open this up. And let's go to miscellaneous. And I'm just gonna I'm gonna put all of this stuff in here and see what happens. <laughs> uh I mean I that's what I think I need to do. I don't know. Could be completely wrong about that. I guess it would turn those into dirty water bottles and then we would put them in here. I think. Eh, I don't know. Well, there's only one way to find out. I have no idea. And uh, so we'll just have to figure it out. All right. Moira? Oh, I can't wait to hear. Uh, I haven't found enough mole rats. Wow. It repels them that much? I can't wait for your full rep. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, can you repair my equipment? Nah, she can't repair it at all. Shit. Well, the other option is to go back out to the military robot dude at Seneca Station and just buy some repair kits from him to repair that. That's probably what we're going to have to do. Except for I don't have enough caps for that at the moment. All right, everybody, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.